Representative Cohen uh, for this important piece of legislation. I want you to just listen very carefully to these timeless yet powerful words from Dr. Martin Luther King. The ultimate measure of a man is not where he stands in moments of comfort and convenience, but where he stands at times of challenge and controversy. As we stand on the edge of a constitutional crisis, I believe it is a time of challenge and controversy. It's sad that my colleagues on the other side of the aisle in leadership like being the leader until it is time to lead. And what we have seen is that it is just easier, safer, to just simply walk away than to provide the checks and balances that their position requires. And then we've also heard those on the other side of the aisle engage in what I now call political theater. Instead of making the tough choices, they simply say, oh, the president would never fire the special counsel when the president has made it quite clear and almost daily now that he would like to do nothing better. And as he becomes, the president I'm talking about, more and more unhinged, without this important piece of legislation, I believe the removal of Mr. Rosenstein and Mr. Mueller is imminent. I am proud that we are a nation of laws, and I could not have been more honored to be an enforcer of the law for almost three decades. So I believe the rule of law is not only important to us on the Judiciary Committee, but it is important to every man and woman living in this country. So I believe it's mandatory that the current special counsel and future special counsels be protected from arbitrary firing and that they cannot be removed for good cause. Unless they are involved in misconduct, we certainly have not seen that from Mr. Mueller or dereliction of duty, he certainly not the one guilty of that, or violation of Justice Department policies. Ladies and gentlemen, we are a nation of laws, and no one, no one is above it. Thank you.